All right, that's the right. cold open. That's the cold open. And I've got this thing. There's over. the trailer. <laughs> Bottle battle. <laughs> Thanks for joining us today. Welcome back to the channel. I'm Justin, this is Eric, and that's Jesse. Uh, today we're doing a battle between the Old Fitzgerald 8-year and the Old Fitzgerald 10-year. Um, these are both bottled and bond. This one is from spring of 2021. It's getting dangerously low. Not just a bottle battle, this is a bottle kill. Bottle Video. kill. And this one's actually from spring of 2023. Uh, so two years apart, same season. They're both in the spring. This is 2021. This is 2023. So real quick, I mean, that means that these were barreled the same time, right? Same time. Eight year, 10 year and 21, 23. So this might even be like the same distillate and everything. Yep. It's two years older. Which one do you want to pour first guys? We got to start with the eight year. All right. I feel like we have to. We'll do the younger brother. I'm, I'm interested to see how much of a difference the two years makes. I mean... I do Don't drop that. Love the decanter. Oh. <laughs> There's not much there, so I mean, am I even going to get to try some? I hope gonna, not. I'm going to pour a little bit extra for me and Pew, so Jesse just has to <laughs> listen to what our tasting notes are. That's fair. You get one shot at this. As much as it pains me to say this, I feel like you nailed the pores on that one. Yeah. Right. I don't know what you were doing with the bottle with this little bit let's, of liquid in it. Let's see how good I actually am. Let's see how good I actually am to split these apart. I Pretty got good. good. Let's say you put a laser on that. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about. I don't know if it's because it's so old or been sitting in that empty bottle or maybe it's just I have so little, but the nose is kind of faint. It's, it's, it's a flat thing. nose. I think it's because it's almost empty. I'm actually shocked you were able to, to save even this much of it for as long as you did. I did it for you. Well, I appreciate it. Right. This was a good bottle when we first got it. It's delicious. Our buddy of ours, Jason Roberts, actually has uh, another bottle of this. So, And both of these come in at 100 proof. Yep. So, unfortunately, right, a little proof down. Um for my taste, right? I know everybody likes something a little bit different, but I tend to go for the higher proof stuff. It is very good though. I do anything Old Fitz makes, I I love it. Yep. And if you get the one There's nothing wrong with it. If you get the bottle of mine with the decanter, I mean there's nothing there's no prettier bottle out there than I'll this. tell you, I'm gonna go bold here and say if we were doing this blind, I feel like I could one hundred percent nail it. That's a weeded bourbon, right? Like, I mean, it is the classic wheat notes. It's very sweet, yeah. very light. The finish is a little bit lacking, um, Which but overall, pretty good. Yeah, very good. All right, now on the ten-year big brother here. I'm still going to give you a little little splash here. So I'm coming over tomorrow, and you're going to have what the seventeen-year and the nineteen-year, right? So we can yeah. really compare like the two. Yeah, I difference. hope so. Right, we'll do the whole vertical. So again, these are both from the spring season. This is 2021, this is 2023. They smell very similar. So I'm not picking up a lot of differences on the nose. I, I, I defer to you on the nose though, because you, you get in there real good. And... Right. There's definitely more ethanol coming off the new one. Yeah. I mean, it's also for a fairly fresh track from the looks of it. Yeah. That's down about the shoulder. That's really got about the same flavor profile. Um, maybe a little more smooth. Mm -hmm. You can tell it's been sitting in a barrel a little longer, maybe. But uh, uh, blind, I wouldn't be able to pick them out. I don't know. I feel like I'm getting quite a bit more... I get a bit more flavor out of this one. I mean, it's still similar profile. Still a little watered down for what I would prefer. But um, I think you can taste a little more of that kind of oak. Um, mm -hmm. It just feels a little more concentrated, maybe. Yeah. Well. Uh, head to head, who'd you give the nod to? For me, I actually think I like the eight year better. I'm gonna say I'm a fan of that bottle, though. Future videos, we should have done this blind. Uh, 
but I'm going to have to, I think I'd go with the 10 year. I think there's just a little bit more flavor to it. And as I said before, I'm not able to pick them out um, too differently. So I like them both. I, I, I don't have a favorite. Now, what do these run roughly like MSRP? Definitely on the fence on this one. He never but these are decisions. on 180. It's a must pick. It is a, yeah, it's a, it's a must pick if you can get an MSRP. No, but it's aren't a they must about, pick. No, I can't pick. <laughs> I'm, not right. I'm right in the middle. You can't abstain from voting. Right yeah. in the Everybody middle. Everybody places a vote. Um, I'll, I'll vote for the independent candidate. How's that? Apparently, we have a no contest. <laughs> we'll go ahead one and edit judge, you out of this One person. judge has it 10 9, video. and the second judge has it 10 9, <laughs> and the third judge forgot turning the score <laughs> We can't see the final That's favor. True. It is a battle. It is a battle. Well, since it's a battle and I'm a judge, I'll have to I'll have to pick. My nod goes to the tenure. Right. I hate you both. <laughs> Alright, so what would you what did you pay for these? Do you remember? I do not remember what I paid for them. I was close to MSRP. Um, I know the MSRP on this one I think is around 80 to 85 bucks. I want to say this one is somewhere between like 110, 115. Um, secondary, I think these go, I don't know, four to 500 bucks to me. I don't know if I'd ever pay anywhere close to secondary for these. They're good, but they're not, I would not pay secondary. They're not four or $500 good, no. but not for a hundred proof leader. I mean, as good as it is, it's still not $400 good. Right. And honestly, I mean, 80, what, 140? 140, yeah. I, I guess said 110, but yeah. Even it's though I would pick in the, in the battle, right? The, this is, a, I think, a, a hair better. It's not $50 better. I mean, I would right. buy the eight year and be perfectly happy. Yes, I, assuming you can find them at MSRP, right? right. Or even secondary. If it's 400, 500, or whatever the case is, I mean, the eight year is going to win again. I mean, if you just have to have it, uh, there's not that much of a difference. Right. In our area, one of the only ways you're going to get these bottles is by signing up for a lottery and getting selected. Right. But the good side of that is it is MSRP, right? right? So, not enough for you to get a little more? I was going to do it. Oh. Change well, I'll mind. take another sip of the winner. All right, we're going to toast the winner here. Cheers to the winner. <laughs> Cheers to the winner. I'm here for the sips. <laughs> I'm sitting you what, one? A little awkward silence for the pours, but that's uh, all right. Uh, All right, real quick, uh, do us a few quick favors. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment below if you agree with our rankings or have other thoughts. Make sure you click that like button. That helps us out. Cheers. Cheers.